I've been metal detecting now for almost three years. Keeps me from smoking and drinking all the beers. And when I fall my first coin, I can hardly believe my luck. Was a big old penny just lying in the muck. Good morning, homie hunters, and here we are. We're back at another Tories digs, and we're back at the fields we were on last week because it's a massive field. Plus, we've got a, a few other fields, and they deserve another go because four hammies came up and loads of silver last week. And um, you see, he's with me this week again. He was off last week with the virus. Don't go spreading the rumours. <laughs> Similarly, the virus is in Cumbernauld. Ah, the virus when they live in Cumbernauld. Right, okay guys. We're just waiting for Toddy coming and we'll get on to the, the field. Now Toddy's got, uh, he texted us last night to say he had the Quest machine in. Um, he's got the Simplex in and he's got Garrett's in. Um, three good entry level machines. Um, no a lot to pick between them I don't think. But Toddy will tell you more about it all himself. And put, put, what, what was that about the t-shirts? Aye. See, he's got one <laughs> job today and he can't even mind them. The post I put on the Facebook page, if you're one of the two guys that won a t-shirt, just see Toddy the next day get it. Put your size and Aye. get a t-shirt. Aye. Gavin Locke's got one coming and who's the other guy? Sarunas. <laughs> <laughs> what? Not sure if I said that right. <laughs> Never said it right. Tom Smith's got one coming. Right, catch you later, guys. Right, guys, Mox is up here, straight on the field, army straight away. No messing about this morning with this guy. He'll not be sleeping the morning of the day. I'm jealous, mate. I'm jealous. Cracker. This is where I got my wee silver last week, I think. Aye. Oh aye, nice one mate, well done. Hey, get the wire brush on and clean it up a wee bit to see it. Keep away from it. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, I see Bruno talking to Toddy out here. Let's see what he's got. What'd you pick? What'd you get mate? Scottish. Oh, lovely mate, well done. Uh, we could be a robot of David, but we're going to do it. Was it two feet down? A little warm. Just dumped uh, two feet down. No, I think it's a robot. Robert. He's a C-Rod OB. Aye. Yeah. Well, well done, mate. And they get a nice James gun money. Oh, yeah, that's crap. You'll see money there, oh, there as well as the groats. I'll find one of these robots on my side. Guys, here's yeah. Rick's got a cartwheel. Who did you? reckon it was a puff. Well, I've never heard, I've never heard ah, a cartwheel. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you Ah, it just was the one date, wasn't it, for them? Ah, well, the one date on them, but I think they've done them for a couple of years. Well, that was some shower of rain there, we just got soaked, but no bad. It's been good up until now, um, but I just found a wee, well, I think it's a horseshoe. But then I don't see any holes in it, but it might be corroded over, but it's the smallest horseshoe I've ever found. And look at that, wee tiny thing. Well, you can fit it in your hand. I thought it might have been off the Healy about even, but no, I think it goes round too much to be off a Healy about. Pretty sure it's a wee horseshoe. But that's the wee one I've ever found. I'll hold, I'll hold on to that. Usually I get rid of them, but I'll hold on to that one because it's small. It's not a penalty. 
Okay, mate. What is it? What is it? That's a Bobby. Bobby? It's a wee Bobby. Six, 1600. 1600. Oh, well done. Oh, Jim. <coughs> Jim. That's <coughs> your bronze age. Oh, you're <coughs> Did you find that? My first time. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh you're yeah, beauty. You got an ox. What machine you got? Sorry? What machine? Garrett 250. A Garrett? Garrett's the best machine. <laughs> Sorry, what's your name? Arda. Arthur. Right, we'll see this. Ah. Arthur. 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 Flat Arthur. Right, that's, we're going to get that this one. Is, this is sewed together. No, that's a door, door knob, I would say. Maybe, that's yeah. not that old, but that's older. What do you think, Jim? We'll get a phone, we'll get an ID, that looks old. Yeah. It's the colour. Send it to Ali, isn't it? Oh, well done. Put the back out of the big I can next week. Yeah, that's <laughs> old. That's old. Is that a jump? That'll jump for you, can't the car. See, it's hollow down at that side. Look, the phone. How is old, think? How is old? We don't know, but I'm by thinking Roman or Bronze Age. That's what that's coming across as me, uh, is Roman or Bronze Age. A big pin of some sort is old. We need to find out what that is. I've never seen anything like it, but it's the colour, uh, the colour and the style. Very nice. Treasure Trove Scotland. Aye. Yes. Reported to Treasure Trove aye. Edinburgh. Treasure Trove you Scotland. Say, you say you the link? No, the link's on. I'll, if you email me, I'll send you the link. Right. And put it on and record it with a treasure trove and they'll record that. It's a good bit of Scottish history. I've Fantastic. never seen anything like it. Fantastic. Look how it's got that wee bit in there too. Aye, it's, it's got some. It's been specially made for something. This is... Look. And here's your bobby. Uh, That's your bobby. Uh -huh. Well done. Are these same colour in that one? Yeah. Uh -huh. Ah, but it's different. This is older. Aye. Well done. Keep that, keep that separate. Keep it in your car. Yeah. Right. Aye. Hey, hello, <coughs> Alex's Harry <coughs> Hunters. Stop coughing. <laughs> I'm spreading the virus. Right, I know we've got a coronavirus <laughs> here. Right. Hello, everybody. It's Toddy here. I want to tell you about how good a day we've been having for a start. But I think we're about five hammered up, Alex. Oh, five or six day. hammered. And Possi good ones. Possible Bronze Age, but about five or six hammered up. Um, and that's for second week in this field. As you can see, it's absolutely enormous sight. But what I want to tell you is we've got. The Quest uh, machines in stock. Uh, my first Scottish dealer for them up here. So if you're interested, they're all under 300 quid. They're absolutely excellent machines. There's machines under 200. They're waterproof, rechargeable, excellent discrimination ability, um, bulk qualities, second to none. So if you're looking for a machine to start up in the hobby for the summer coming, the day the beach, the day land, the day everything. So if you're interested, Look up my website www.metaldetectingscotland.co.uk and you'll see them in there. I'll find that out for you when I get home. Very that's good. What is it? It's a Scottish, a Scottish. I'm sure it's either a Mary or a James. James is six. You're talking 1500s. Oh, well. That looks the same signal as all that chunk that's coming up. Ah, a good one up there, Arthur. Sorry, what's your name again? Mark. Mark. What machine are you using? Uh, Fisher F22. Ah, uh, you get a lot of coke. With single frequency machines, you get a lot of coke, uh, mate. Right, it's quite bad. Oh, I think. But, aye. Uh, oh, nice. Oh, that's, that's a beauty, Alec. Look, you that? got your video. There you go. <laughs> He's put it on the Facebook page. Alright. <laughs> that's, right, that's a Scottish for about the 1500s. Oh, well done. Yeah, mate, I'll give you my hold I'll give you a bag for that. Right guys, here's here's Don over here. By a hammy. Well done mate. Thanks for your hammy. Oh no, what is that an Eddie? An Eddie, aye. London Mint, you think? Oh good, good. Well done mate.
Right guys, I think that's the something else up. What have we got? Queen Anne. A Queen Anne? Nice. Oh well done mate. Alright, oh, nice. Well done. Is that in this bit here too? Just between that green bin and the red sign there, up there. Some wee bit this, isn't it? Yeah, that's a good point, isn't it? Well done, mate. What I was saying with the E at the bottom, it's an Edinburgh mint. It's got the E at the bottom. Oh, right, uh, I see that. He's ducks. Wait, wait a minute, I haven't got it on yet. <laughs> <laughs> but he's on <all> now. <laughs> <laughs> great day, great, great day, day, hard by all. Look at that. Only a okay. ducks. Brilliant. Eh, I know. Oh, I got was a fucking horseshoe. <laughs> a fucking horseshoe. It wasn't even a big one. It was tiny thing. It's a pony. Bye. <laughs> Well hello there my hammy hunting friends and we've had a great day today. A good wee bit of banter there for the last 10 minutes. I'm freezing my roast on here. <laughs> Cracking jokes and all that. Um, so it's been really good. But there have been a lot of nice coins come up today. Um, a lot of Scottish ones come up. And nothing for me. They're my prize find today. My wee horseshoe. I'll get the Dremel on <laughs> But... Ah, it's still been a good day, so I've no idea where we are next week. Uh, again, it depends on the land. A lot of the land's all waterlogged and we or the bad weather we've been having, but no doubt Toddy will get us something. So until we meet next week <coughs> on another Toddy's Digs, Scotland's number one, and remember, uh, he was saying he's got Quest machines in, he's also got Simplexes in and got um, we Garrett's in too, I think. Uh, and they're all good entry level. In fact, <laughs> only thing entry level about them, I think, is it's the price. Uh, because they seem to be decent wee machines. So, if you want to get into this game, get yourself up to Toddy and uh, have a wee try out at the different machines and see what you want. I mean, for under 200 quid, I think you can get a, a wee detector now to get started. So, anyway, I'm gibbering. Until we meet next week on another Toddy's Digs. Number one in Scotland, you guys take care, be safe, good luck, happy hunting. And when I fall my first coin, I can hardly believe my luck. Was a big old penny just lying in the muck. Hey, you can't dig here, you can't dig there, that's what I heard him say. You're gonna have to leave now and don't come back this way. I was looking for some old coins, but I didn't have much luck. He said it was a lame excuse and he didn't.